Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today is episode 3 of Daily 2K22, My Rise. And we'll be starting off by looking at their messages from Shawn Michaels. Maybe he because you were the... Well, you were wrong, but one thing. I wouldn't have done the same thing 24 years ago. I wouldn't have gotten caught. Sure. Lucky break me well fought televised or not still counts as an NXT debut in my book. I remember my own lost a tough one. So you have one more win in your column than I did. Okay. Cool. You've been hearing some good news about your progress and I have some potential big news. Last time you said there was big news, it turned out we were getting air fresheners, locker room holds were in that. The man in was a game changer. Anyways, this is big. I heard the GMs might be taking their way down so you were right, that is big. Yep, if you think you're ready, I can pull some strings to make it happen. Or if you think you need more training time, I can solve for a bit. I think we're gonna do some more quests in the performance center. So, I'll wait there. Nothing wrong with wanting the best fit for it. I'll delete the gingers down here, but I can't keep them around forever. At some point, you will have to show them that you've already got it. Talk soon. Okay. Well. It's, well. Because I there's still five more that I can do or more still quite a few more so let's talk to Road Dog. Hey, big news! We got another member of DX coming to help out for a bit at the PC. Hornswoggle? Uh, no. One of the members of the best version of DX, X Pac. You know, I have to agree that the DX you were a part of was the best one. Damn straight it was. But you know who disagrees? Shawn Michaels. You guys took what they started and made it ten times better. That's what I always say. Anyway, what if when X-Pac is here, we had a match to settle this debate? You, me, and X-Pac against Shawn, Hector, and Chase. <laughs> that sounds You're awesome. So and if we win, I get to be an honorary member of DX? Let's not go crazy. Okay, Battle of DX. Okay. And with a slam to John Michaels reverses. Okay. And reversing. And the combos. And slam. Elbow draw. And splash right onto him. Combo time. The headbutt. And just beating him down. Reversal from Sean. Oh. And Hector Floors taking himself in. Yeah, something. And a reversal. Sean, what are you doing? Yeah. Uh, DDT. Hector and Chase getting in. And Chase getting it kicked and choked in the corner. Now. An elbow drop to chase and stomp him away. And now picking him up 
and slam him right down. No, bring oh reversal by chase and slam him to the ground. And a hurricane runner from Chase. Stunner from Chase. And legs stomp to the arm. Oh, and another hurricane runner from Chase. And picking Leon Taylor up. And throwing him into the corner. And taking Hector Flores and double the arm drag throw thing. I know how a hot take works. But Hector Flores being the legal man, turning Leon over and a stomp to the face. And Chase getting tagged in and still being stunned, can't do anything. And become unstunned. Xbox hitting Chase. And the slaps. The spinning Iranagi. And going to the top rope. And flying and a splash. And an elbow drop right to the face. And punch and not a kick. And reversing, and now grabbing him and lifting him up and pushing him up and down and throwing, dropping him on the mat. No, 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 chase. And an elbow, flying elbow drop right to chase. And picking him up, and the finisher to chase. He reversed the drag. Oh, and Chase reversed the punch. And the Russian arm leg sweep. And tag to Hector Flores. And a kick to the face. And reversing. And then, oh. Yeah, drop kick to the knee. And missing the moonsault. A drop kick to Road Dog. And he's stunned. I know that that is not Road Dog. And what's the signature? Oh, missing the signature. And then arm neck breaker from Hector. And another neck breaker. And bring him up. And pulling him into his own corner, but getting reversed. And the signature punch, punch, and the fourth punch. How do you drag? I'm trying to escape, but not being able to. And just choking him on the ropes. And a reversal to the kick. Now, with the. What a dousting drop. How do you drag? What a drop kick. Now, going for the pin. One, One two, two, and not being able to finish the drop. And a double axe handle. And now, someone being stunned. I think Sh Shawn Michaels is stunned. No. The tag to X Park. The kick, slap, slap, and a 
kick to the back and a running leg drop. And ooh, a reversal from Hector. And a backbreaker also from Hector. And taking to Chase and oh a signature from here. And going to his corner. And ooh, what a drop. A move from X Pac. And now in the middle of the ring a face thing. I don't know what it's called. And now one, two, three. That is a good match. X Pac pinning chase for the win. back in the performance center yep about the X has been completed and we do have some new notifications thanks for the invite to the PC road doc always have pass my knowledge on interaction and have to still pass my fists on to Shawn Michaels okay nothing there now let's talk to road dog again see if what Tango una gran oportunidad para ti. That's Spanish for I got a big opportunity for you. Estoy interesado. Not bad, right, Pero de Camilo? Anyway, what's the oportunidad all about? WWE was contacted to send a PC student to El Mago's retirement show in Mexico. They actually requested Hector, but for some reason he doesn't want to do it. So if you're interested, we'll have a triple threat between you, Paragon, and Chase to decide who will go to face El Mago's son, El Mago Jr., at the event. Oh, no. mi vuelo, which means book my flight. I only looked up that one sentence, so I'll take your word for it. Okay, El Mago retirement show. Let's do this. Okay, hmm. triple grip has begun. And starting off with Paragon. So, oh, and going to chase. And a running soldier tackle. And a spinning Yuranagi. Nope, not what I wanted to do. I can do Oh. I was swooping over the top rope. Now, Chase going to the outside. And now, with a spinning, you're ignoring to the outside. And now, a very vicious punch to the back of the head. And now, Gain a steel chair. Now, ooh, a neck breaker right on the chair. Yeah. Oh, and she's missing the dive. Ooh, a chair shot right to the head. And then, oh, and a paragon again hitting the dive and like chase. Oh, 
is exchanging blows on the outside. Ooh, what a suplex. The outside. And Chase, why are you attacking me? A few punches to the head. Oh, Chase, save me. Ah, oh, that, that was long. Okay. Both Paragon and Chase in the inside the ring. I throw in Chase to the outside. Okay. And a punch right to the stomach. Ooh, I slam right down. Oh, and a stunner from Chase. How am I stunned? I mean, I guess I did get stunnered. Okay. Now, hopefully, neither one of them hits their signature. Because they both, well, Chase almost had it. And Paragon does have it. No, getting up. Now, what's Paragon looking for? Ooh, what? And bring him up and bring him right back down for the T drop. Now, going for the pin. One. Okay, I'm just missing. Mm. A close line to the outside. No. No. Oh, and a zigzag right onto the. Oh no. Paragon J. Pierce dodging the spinning kick. And there's punches repeat. Punch right to the back. And a reversal. Chase and German suplex. Right to chase. And a German. Oh, one. And a. Ooh, a very big clothesline. Okay, and Chase has his signature. Okay, and Chase is being thrown to the outside. Now, both on the apron. And back body drop onto the apron. Now, getting up. The yeah. Taylor, getting up. Grabbing the chair. And just waiting for someone else to come. Oh, that did not work. Oh, and chase. Is the one who gets in the ring. Bring him up. P pushing him up and down. And just dropping him. Oh no. In a submission. Okay, and something. But it is a rope break. I'm going for the pin, but that should be rope break. One. Nope. An easy kick out. No. Ooh, the spin heel kick and chase. 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 Oh, oops. Both missing their moves. And the spinning heel kick. And now going for the pin. And breaking it up. Is Paragon Jeepers in a spinning year Nagi? Right, um, I'm only getting to a count of one. Getting up. In a spinning drop thing. Chase. And Dragon. No, no, I'm not Dragon him. No. Chase reversing. Now, getting him up 
to the side of the back the T drop. Going for the pin. One. Nope. Now, the spinning heel kick. And is that it for Paragon? And one, two, three. It looks like so. Paragon J Pierce is out to the spinning heel kick. Now, we've booked her ticket to, Me to Mexico to face El Mago Jr. Okay, will the match happen right now? Nope. Okay, Hector. Good luck against El Mago Jr. in Mexico. I hope you beat him. That's the plan. I've been meaning to ask. Why didn't you want to go? Yeah, um, just wasn't feeling it. It would have been a chance for you to compete in your home country. And you're probably a fan of El Mago, right? I was, but he wasn't a fan of me. That's all I can really say. Just go get the win over Mago Jr. Okay. Kinda suspicious. Just got word that you will face my son El Mago Jr. at my tournament show. Which won't let young Perry. Boy, I got your part to see. That means I will win it for you. Or I'll make no idea what that means though. Okay, we're in Mexico at the Lucha Libre show. And El Mago Jr. coming out with El Mago in his corner. Get the point. We are here with starting off with a spinning your Nagi going to the top rope already. They miss splash. I'm just walking away. The kick with the ginormous headbutt. El Mago Jr. is already bleeding. I'm going to the top rope. Going for the splash and hitting the splash. And I'm going to the top rope again. But this time, the elbow drop connects. Now, El Mago Jr. getting up and getting kicked in the face. Okay, that did not work. Oh, and absolutely destroying elbow. And elbow drop right to El Mago Jr. And, and another elbow drop. Just stomping away on El Mago Jr. Oh, and giant kick. Oh, um, the turn buffer. Now, getting El Mago Jr. up. Bringing him. Oh, nope. El Mago Jr. reversing the signature. Ooh, and a jumping uh, drop kick as the signature. It did connect. But easily kicking out. Not getting up. A ginormous punch to the stomach. And a shoulder tackle. Now going up to the top rope 
jumping and a ginormous splash. No. Nope, not where I want to. Now from the corner. Getting ready. Getting ready. I'm waiting for the perfect moment to strike with the glorious sneak. Bringing El Mago Jr. up and dropping him da right down. Going for the pin. And it's a rope break. Of course it is. Now going for another pin. One. Only a one count from the referee. But El Mago Jr. looks hurt. No. Strike after strike. Uppercut after uppercut. And kick after kick. Reverse after reverse. No. I'm going for the pin. I'm going for the dirty pin. One, two, three. And that's the match. Good match by El Mago Jr. Losing at your retirement show. And that is maybe the storyline complete. That is indeed the show, the story complete. Oh, I go. Nice to meet you, show. Say hi to Hector Flores for me when you see him. Okay. And Hector Flores, heard you picked up the W over El Mago, over Mago Jr. Congrats, man. Bit suspicious still. Okay, and I'm going to end it off for that episode there. I hope you liked it, and I'll see you next time.